Hey guys, it's Simon, and I know it's been a while since I made a video, but um, I thought I'd make one today. I'm at work today, and uh, the market's been a little bit stressful for the last couple weeks. Um, I think I finally figured it out. This week was finally green. Last week was not so much, um, and today was actually a nice uh, four-figure profit day on um, uh, Google Trade and Apple Trade. And uh, so I wanted to make a quick video on how to do, to set alerts. And I know everybody, I think most people know how to set an alert for um, a regular stock. So I'm actually going to just put up a screen for just like Netflix and I'll actually maximize that. So if you want to set an alert um, for when the stock price hits a certain um, value up or down, you just go, you right click on the chart and you click on create alert and then you can either set it at or above or at or a below or at below or above and you just type in whatever price you want now that's not what this video is about the video is actually about how to do it with um options so i have some hail mary plays which i call hail mary plays because i buy them and they're a one-year expiration like pfizer i bought originally i had bought 40 um contracts of pfizer for 19 cents each so nineteen dollars I sold ten of them for a profit uh, when it hit 32 it's at 32 now um, but I'm gonna wait till it hits about 44 before I hit before I sell another batch um, so I recovered half of my cost on the actual options or almost half of my cost um, when it hits 44 I'll sell another 10 and that will actually um, put me at square so the other 20 options contracts will be basically all profit so in order to do this, you right click on your options contract and then you go down to more info and then you send this to one of your TOS charts. And so I'm going to send it to my third chart, which is the one that I have maximized right now. So once I do that, I'm just going to take a second. My um, internet's not great here. And then I'll maximize this. So now I have the actual options chart. So it's trading. You can see where it's trading at as far as options prices go instead of the underlying. Um, which is what a normal chart would show you. So in order to set alert here, you do the same thing. You just hit create alert. Um, I have mine set at 44, um, at or above 44. You can change it to whatever you want to. If you're um, using a put or a call, depending on whether you're using a pull or put or a call. And then um, once that's done, you just hit create. And you have a couple other options down here, which notifies what kind of sound you want it to make. And then you can also have it send to your mobile device, which I do for my app. So that way, if I'm not next to my computer, I also see the alert. And then the other option is to actually have a specified time and date um, that it will, the alert will be valid until. I've never changed this, so I just leave it valid until I just cancel it manually. So I'm canceling that out because I already have a 44 mark alert set here. And that's, a simple quick video on how to set an option alert on an options contract <laughs> sorry about that had a little bit of a brain fart hope everybody's doing okay on the market um, if you want to take a look at my blog I've been giving a little bit of um, tips on what kind of stock to look for in the market that's being affected so negatively with the coronavirus scare um, and then also some other um, some opinions on what would make your trading a little bit better but if you want to see those uh, my blog website is simon simple simon i am simple simon.com sorry it's www.iamsimplesimon.com have a good one guys and have a great weekend